Welcome ladies and gentlemen to another indie horror game. This is Satellite Odyssey, a series of adventure games about human exploration of space. This is the prologue of the opening part of the game series, where we'll be taking control of Laska, a Soviet biologist and a member of the scientific space expedition Icarus. Hopefully we won't fly too close to the sun. So without further ado, let's begin this odyssey. And it seems we have awoken from our cryo sleep chamber, perhaps? Apparently, this is heavily inspired by um, Russian sci fi. Um, so, if you're an Andrei Tarkovsky fan, i.e., Solaris, then I think this game might be for you. Put on the station staff uniform. We will do that. Thank you very much. We've got our sneakers on. And our glasses. Right. So was that my pod? No, this is my pod over here. So is this someone else's pod? Hmm. I don't speak Russian, so... Oh. Someone else. Ah. That seems... Hello. What? What is... If I right-click, it goes into some weird... Hmm. That might be a mechanic of the game later on that we're not yet adapt to? I don't know. We'll see. So, this is the kind of pot area. Oh, hello. And either people are sleeping in their chambers. There seems to be one that just Hulk smashed it. He Hulk smashed his way out. We open normally. Alright. Do I have a flashlight? Can I see what's going on? Ah. Yeah, we'll turn you off. Look at these little fat suits, these little compression suits. I love it. it. Does have that alien vibe, and I'm all for that. What am I taking here? What is this? Ticket of some description? Ah, we've got a quest log here. Place the punched card into the recorder. What recorder? I do not see... What the hell? We got Space Roomba. Hey, little guy. Okay. All right. <laughs> what do we have over here? Do we have medical pack? No. What is this? Q grab. What is that? Oh, so I can pick things. What is that, though? Ah. Not entirely sure. And then we have... Ah. A collectible, perhaps? A coin? Not too sure. Hmm. I'm liking the aesthetics. Is this the... Closed. No, apparently not. Oh. Pressure seem good. I have no idea. I have no idea if that's good or not, but, um... Okay. A bright, shiny new day. Well... Glad to see you again on board the Soviet Interplanetary Space Station, Icarus. Hi, Zoria. According to the rules, after anabiosis, it is necessary to undergo a health examination. Yes, I know. Oh, these rules. Insert the ticket into the registration machine. Okay. Hal 9000? <laughs> yeah. Okay, we got some bulls here. Uh, well, that's the thing. I just want to check out what's going on over here first. Oh. It does seem like there are things that I can, like, this seems like a walkie-talkie of some description. A very lo-fi futuristic version of a walkie-talkie, but we can't pick it up at the moment. Apparently, oh, I don't like that. Can you Can you get me if I'm here? I can use something on you, apparently. Okay. Interesting. I'm liking this. I'm liking the aesthetic. I'm liking the... 
I don't like the fact that the radio just turned on again. But it's got that really 90s Euro... Trash vibe going on. I'm guessing this is meant to be kind of set in the kind of 60s or 70s, but the kind of post-Soviet era version of what it is. I'm liking it. All right, let's put the little... Comrade, I will perform five squats for you. One, two, three, four, five. I don't remember it sounded like this before. While you were asleep, I generated many, many, many variations of this song. Ah, uh, the old audio tune. Wait, you did it? That's amazing. It sounds like someone's singing it. <laughs> Where do you like it? Examination procedure. Step two. Camera proceed to the treadmill. I will not. I will not run a hundred meters on a treadmill. Okay. I love this little guy doing his little cleanup clue. Yeah, I can see. And I love, I love the fact that you can see my legs. Got my converse in there and everything. All right. Ouch. Shit. I guess. Shit. Hey, now, come on. Shit, shit, shit. Come shit, on, Zoria. No. Shit. Play along or be angry. Oh. Oh, I see what's going on. The AI has, like, the mind capacity of a child. We have to scold it, right? Zarya, stop! I don't want Misha to hear it. Oh no! Not Misha! Don't worry. I won't let anyone hurt you. Thank you, Laska. Hmm. Examination procedure. Step 2. Camera, proceed to the treadmill. Yes, comrade. <sighs> I'm coming. Okay. Walking on the treadmill. And we are flying. Oh, okay. We've got to run. So, we're near Saturn. How long till we reach the Earth? Zoria? Zoria? Oh, she's gone offline. Sorry. I had to check on the other module. So, how is it? Everything is fine, Laska. Don't worry. Examination procedure. Step 3. Ball camera. Before exercises for hand coordination. <sighs> is everything in order? People don't say that, Zoria. Please take the ball and throw it into the hoop. Yes, that's much better. Mm. I'm sorry. That's how Misha programmed me. Okay, so let's see. Throw a basketball into the hoop. Um, I feel like we're dealing with a very malfunctioning AI here. Or a computer that has some kind of willpower of it as a child. We'll see. Where's the hoop? Oh, the hoop's here. Uh, Kobe. And get it in. All right. I hope a throwing mechanic is not part of this. Hang on. Oh, Olympics. Got the Olympic rings and everything. Come on. Shit. Let's finish the examination. No. I'm not in the mood I'm going to get it in. Come on. According to the rules, we must complete examination. I will. I'll get it. Rules are made to be broken, Zora. Oh. Don't be so boring. Boring. I'm getting this. <laughs> God damn it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God damn. What's happening now? Zarya? What the hell? It seems there was a power surge at Icarus Station. Check what happened. I'll go find a flashlight. Sure. Well, she doesn't seem that fussed about it. During the examination light, when I'll find a flashlight, was I solving the problem? Usually in the cabinet near the cryo capsules. Okay. We're going. Ah. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's the flashlight. Okay. Oh. A lantern. 
Oh, that is... That's terrible. That's terrible light. Can I wind this up? It seems like it's low on batteries. And if you've watched my channel but at all, you'll know one thing I like. Oh, I see. Right, there we go. Well, the power seems to be back on anyway. Is that I love... Come on now. Don't be playing silly buggers with me. Flashlights that yet, but this is like the automatic wind up. That's got the amnesia sort of feel to it. Hello, Misha. Uh, where are you, Misha? Oh, is this the new magazine? What do we have here? Shift log. Um, okay, I th okay, so it's the the late eighties. There's nothing behind it. Okay, interesting. I can't believe we had so many issues together and haven't killed each other. Or have we? Um, is there some kind of telecommunication device? Closed. That I can use? Or some kind of... Ah. Ah, the walkie-talkie, of course. Are you there? What happened? Did something happen? I thought I've just heard Misha. He was asking for help. Uh oh, I'm afraid you got it wrong. Michael is in his room and he's fine. I'm not wrong. I'm sure I heard it. Most likely it was interference caused by the radio. Yeah, Plus I don't think it was that. Antibiosis isn't an easy procedure. You are tired. You should go to your room, lie down, and rest. Yeah, maybe you're right. I do actually have a headache. Yeah, let's go to Misha's room. Is this Misha's room? Most. Is the door just automatically open for me? It sounded like it has. It has. What the hell are you? Jesus Christ. Danger, Will Robinson! Danger! Have you got... What are you, like some kind of... Suit? Android? That... I want to see what you do. What are you doing? Yes, I'm watching you. I'm watching you perform... Oh, can I... There we go. Oh, I was blocking... That was blocking your way, was it? Oh, that's creepy as hell. I don't like you. You've got, like, some weird Five Nights at Freddy things going on. Oh, you're putting suits in the... You're replacing the suit I just had? Oh, interesting. Yeah, have a good day now. Bye-bye. We're trying to get past you. All right, so... Yeah, I don't speak Russian, but I'm guessing this is the way... Ah. Once again? Oh, God. I don't want that thing coming after me. Oh. Can I talk to you? Where oh, that's your little pod. Okay, you stay in there. I meant to talk to you, right? But it's not giving me the prompt. I feel like there should be a prompt to talk to you now. Yeah. Oh, I see. Plaska, you forgot to check in for your shift. Oh, that was um one letter away from being uh <laughs> So, okay, we're on Icarus, and we're exploring space. Something's clearly happened that I'm not sure of at the moment. But we're on a different level now. Act 2. So we need to... Hey! Is anyone here? Why is there a bottle just randomly... Bouncing around. It's got a good atmosphere. I do like the atmosphere so far. The fire extinguisher. I should be able to pick this up and put it back on, right? 
Okay, it looks like we're... Is that like the cargo hold in there? Alright, I guess we're going up. Misha, are you there? Misha's room? Seems like there's no one. Wasn't there a... You seem to... That I need... Can I... Can I reprogram you? You seem to be... Like you're not knowing where you're going, buddy. Yeah. You're not doing your job. So, Misha's not in his room. So, yeah. Is it... Was it Spotnik? Who was the dog? What was the dog's name that went first into space? I can't remember. Zaria. Looks like someone's been in my room. Oh, this is my room. Oh, so it's detective vision. What is that meant to do? Oh, I see. Right. Oh, there's a leak, Zoria. Is it from the lab? What happened there? I do not trust this what computer. Happened? Did Slipper escape and chew up the water and can again? <sighs> All right, I'll go check. I got to tell you. I'm seeming very nonchalant about things that are going on here. What's in the fridge? Can I do detective... I can do detective vision on the fridge. No, I can't. Is it certain items? I don't know how that really works so far. Well, you don't want to leave a fridge open. But this is my room. January 7th, 1968. It's the fourth time we've done this memory. Such a development hell. Zori is a dead product. We are stuck. We need to admit it. We need to close the project and switch to Proton. Proton is the future. Right, so I'm getting the kind of vibe that Zara was like a, a prototype AI. And yeah, something's gone something's gone awry, I think. And I think we've been put to sleep. Possibly many times before this. But we can do our detective... Oh, consider the composition. Our old our photo... Old photo with Misha. Working on Zoria. Did you two have a fight because of me? Huh? No, no, Zoria. We were just tired of each other. Consider the composition. Or I guess that just means look at the picture. Right. So there are certain things that you can... What's what the vote say? Laska, be careful. Something is on with Zara. I'll go check. Uh, when was that written? Exactly. What I... Oh, footsteps. The door was open. Where is Misha? Zoria, I'll teach you a lesson, you troublemaker. Laska's just sort of sitting here going, you know, oh, you little troublemaker. Oh, you little, little scoundrel. Everything's fine. This is the computer that's, like, making sure you stay alive on this tin bucket that we're on. View magazine. Order of the Minister of Defense of the USSR, number 59, November 5th, 1970. Moscow astronaut roboticist, specialist in the development and maintenance of robots, Mikhail Vitrovich Kuznov, and astronaut roboticist, psychologist, Laska Nikolaevina Kosovanova, on November 5th, 1970, are sent to the space station Icarus to carry out technical maintenance of the robot assistant Zara and to forever glorify our Soviet homeland in the field of robotics. Minister of Defense of the USSR, Marshal of the Soviet Union, V. Shredov. Yes, I am going to be completely butchering Russian pronunciations, and I do apologize. It kind of looks like, I don't know if we're meant to be spinning like this on the axis. It's never a good sign when there's planks of wood. Can I? Hang on. No, I cannot. Can I? No, I cannot. I cannot get any past... What are we meant to be doing here? 
Zarya is behaving strangely. Doesn't answer. I need to go to the hall to check what's going on. Okay. So, we went into our room. Misha's not opening the door in his room. Can we just try his room again? No, apparently not. Can we crouch? I feel like we should... Yes, we can. There we go. Let's check out over here. What is this? A storage room? That looks like a vent I'll be exploring. Can I turn on the light? I could turn on the light in my room. Apparently not in this room. I'm... I'm assuming that's just, you know, stains... I guess this is the main hub, the main area. Cigarette machine, maybe? Zarya, what's going on? Where is Misha? Do you miss him? What? No, you just said he's in the room, but there's no one there. He just left for a minute. Don't worry, I'm sure. You'll find him. You're not telling me something. Yeah, I'm getting the kind of distinct impression that Misha is dead. Zarya. Okay, so there's going to be certain times that I can talk to the AI. Maybe. Perhaps. Waking up. Examination procedure. Recording a station readings. Checking Zarya. Some regular malfunction. Something is off. Making a correction plan of Zarya. Sleep. Physical exercises. Today Zarya locked me and Misha in the hallway while we were fighting. Some behavior error. We were lucky that we didn't lock away the crowbar. I don't know what we would do. Making peace? Sleep. Didn't have a good sleep. Headache. I thought I heard something. As if someone was screaming. Another tough month is coming to an end. I am tired. Can't wait till we reach Earth. Everything will be okay. And then you have the uh, HAL 9000 eyeball scribbled out, perhaps? Zarya plus something, maybe? Don't know what that is. Okay. Okay. I'm getting a kind of sense that Zarya has been based on a kind of... We're the, the, the husband and the wife. Zarya is acting like the child. So she doesn't want us to argue. Is that something, perhaps? Can I talk to you now? Zoria? No, it doesn't matter. Okay. It's interesting. Oh. Hey, are you crazy? What are you doing? Sorry, Laska. I can't let you in there. Oh. Why is that? Following the safety protocol, chapter 3. Hmm. Get to the point, Zoria. You may die. Is this like your... your... I need a crowbar for this. Ah. I heard you, Laska. What do you need a crowbar for? Nothing. I'm okay. Everything's okay. So that's like your brain node or something, right? Oh, I need to get in there. Oh, we have another coin. Don't know what this all means. Oh, God. The cleaning robot's gone. They better not attack me. All I'm saying is that better not attack me later on. I mean, it's going to attack me, isn't it? I'm tired of fighting with her. We were arguing of such a long time with Laska today about Zoria's behavior patterns, but didn't come to an agreement. I don't want to discuss it with her anymore. It's useless. We're wasting our time. The Soviet Union won't postpone the launch because of this foolishness. So Misha had some issues with the Zara AI. That's what I'm kind of thinking here. What do we got? In case Zara starts acting weird, crowbar in the warehouse. Look for the key to it on the back side. Aha. I was just in that room. Okay. Can we go in here though? Closed. No. Is there an easy way to get back that way? No, I have to go back. Okay. You're not going to stop me, are you? Hmm. 
You're going to become a problem, aren't you? I can tell you're going to become a problem later on. I like my little wind-up uh, torch here. Uh, oh, I see. So I'm... Yeah, I get you. Oh, don't want to make the noises. Don't want to make the AI aware of what we're doing. Can I... Use you now? There we go. Aha. And is that a note or is that just a piece of... Okay. Is that hidden? Where is the warehouse? In the locker. What locker? Did I miss the locker? Did I go past the locker? Noises. Space noises. I would assume I need to use the key here, no? Ah, ah, right. There's a screwdriver here. And I need to get... So I need one, two, three... I need to have four coins, it looks like. That's good. I like that. Can I have some coffee? No, we don't want to use the coins, so I need to get more coins. I feel like I should be able to... I feel like that's where I need to go to use the key, but... I don't see any lockers around. Oh, right, it was right there all the time. Ah, oh, there's another key! Alright, it's time to see what's on the second floor. I've probably missed a key somewhere. That's probably going to be my bad. Is the um, computer AI going to let me... Aha! So now I have four coins. Let's try and get the screwdriver. I need one more coin. I need five coins. Yeah, fuck you, rubbish bin. Oh, I need one more coin. I know I've missed a coin somewhere. I'm going to go hunting for this coin. It's got to be around here, right? It's got to be around here somewhere. I don't know why I need the screwdriver yet. I know it's for a reason. There are reasons why I need the screwdriver. I just don't know what they are yet. I'm going to find that goddamn coin. Found it. Right. Don't know why I need a screwdriver just yet, but we're going to um, use the crowbar to get it into your nerve brain thing. If I stand here, would that mean you can't see me? Gotta hammer down that cue. She's not gonna be happy with me now, is she? She is not gonna be happy with me. Well, the rate... Oh, that's a lot of blood. What the hell? Is that blood? And is that his walkie-talkie? Hmm. Misha is acting strange. He spent the whole day in the lab. He was looking for something. He is getting himself into trouble. He knows he is not allowed there. He coughs all the time. Something is wrong. I need to talk to him tomorrow. Sleep. Today Zarya sent me to the neighboring module. She said she had something special for me. She said, it's a surprise. Don't tell Misha. He won't understand. Interesting. Another coin. We will take that. Oh, hi there. Didn't see, <laughs> didn't see you there. Check the second floor. What am I dragging here? Am I dra- Ah. Uh.
What are you guys up to? What's your functioning? Don't know. Can we go in here? Like, apparently not. I'm just going to have a look here. Can we use the lift? We can't use the lift. Closed. Closed. So there was that vent. We will go there. I don't like all these robots just willy-nilly walking around on the... Ah, uh, here we go. Oh. I thought we was going to use a screwdriver for it. Apparently not. That would make sense, right? That the, the, the vent... Ah! Oh. Oh, that didn't look good. Was that me? <gasps> Am I a clone? Is she cloning me? Yeah, this has become very Solaris. Oh dear. Oh! Oh, the walls are coming in. I need to get out. Madam, gotta throw something. Can I go? What? A button? Oh. Can I just crawl back up the vents? Oh, the door opened. I didn't have to do anything. Finally, you're awake. Misha! Oh. I'm in the basement. Here. We're screwed. So you find them already. Uh. What? This means we're also. I don't even want to know. What's going on here? Zoya's gone crazy. Somehow she's creating the scripts. What do you think it's Zoria? Who else? I told you. You shouldn't have been so soft with her. What? Really? Again? She's an instrument, not a child, Laska. She is playing with your emotions. The laws of robotics could only create a psychopath. Now the station is controlled by a killer robot with the mind of a little girl. He did. Right. So now we know. Laska, Laska, are you there? Say something. Oh, fuck. Listen, I'm sorry. I need to figure out what's going on here instead. Okay, I agree. What do you suggest? Is Zoria here right now? No, I don't think so. Alright, listen. I have an idea. We need to distract her somehow. While I sneak to her main processor and reboot it. What do you mean by distract? Are you serious? Just chat with her. I need time. I'll get in touch with you later. Okay, got it. Over. Act three. So are we copy... We're obviously copies of ourselves, right? But how is... How is the robot able to make more of us? Don't know. But we're going to have to... Oh. Hey, now. How are we meant to distract Zarya? Are we meant to just talk to her? What do my notes say? Um, distract her. Hmm. Easier said than done, I'm thinking. Let's just have a chat, perhaps? Maybe I meant to make more... Oh, uh, here we go, yeah. Alaska, glad to see you again. Where have you been? Are you doing alright? Let's talk. Yeah, let's talk. Uh, everything is fine, Zoria. I just... Looking for the coins to get some water. For coins to get some water. That's not untrue. Hmm. <sighs> okay, I feel like I passed her test. Hello. Mm, how are you doing? Great. And how are you? I'm just fan dabby Good. doozy. Good. Mm-hmm. Laska, do you want to say something? Yeah, I'm thinking... Let's play a game. Think of an object and I will bring it to you. Hooray! I love games. 
So I have to get a pillow. Right, so we know where my I don't I don't like these guys. Do not like them. But um I'm guessing we have to go back to our room. Aska, it worked. Zarya's distracted. Keep going. Just make sure you don't get caught. If Zarya realize we're in this together, she killed both of us. Why would you think that? Do you want to test it on yourself? Bad idea. Uh, okay, fine. I think I can see you. Uh, you're in the hallway, right? Uh, come close to the window. Do you see the light on the neighboring module? I do not. Ah, that's where he is. Yeah, I think I can see you too. What's the plan? What's next? Okay. Listen, I'm heading to home, and you'll find the way to the lab in the meantime. You're cutting off. Say that again. Laska? I have to go to the Alicia, lab. Alicia, can you hear me? The radio is calling interference. We need to turn it off. Surely if she's the computer that's kind of, you know, controlling the whole ship, she would be able to hear our communications anyway, right? So what am I meant to be doing here? Oh. Seems like the radio blocks the signal. It needs to be turned off. Oh, I see. Can I pick you up then? I can grab you. Like, so... Do I bring you back to the computer? I guess we're going to find out. So the three radio... Well, I keep on doing this, and they keep on turning on again, so I'm not sure that's exactly right. I don't know if I need to actually bring the pillow or just say it's a pillow. I got it. It's a pillow. A pillow, great. You guessed it. Have you managed to find me, sure? Not yet. Well, no. kind of. Not yet. And the other radio, was that round here? Was that in my room? It would make sense that I had a radio in my room. Where was the other radio? I think Zoria is sensing something. Damn, it looks like we're short of time. We need to find out where this clans came from. Get to the laboratory. Maybe we'll find some answers there. It's closed. <sighs> Got it. I'll try to open it. Uh, but I need you to distract Zoria one more time. Okay, let's try. Right. Hey, Zarya, what kind of new game do you want to play today, huh? Laska, why did you turn off the radio? Don't you like my songs? No, it's not that. I just... Oh, you want to play yourself? Great! Yeah, exactly. Yeah, if only I could remember how to... Everything is leading to the lab. It is closed, though. Distract Zarya again, so Mishka can unlock the doors. Song. Stupid, but I don't have any better idea to talk. I'll try to find notes or try it by myself. I haven't seen any... Oh, I see. I see. Oh, dear. D? Try. What? I'm not entirely sure what... Wrong. 
Okay, it's basically... No? Okay. Okay, so G, C... Does that distract you long enough? Go to the laboratory. Um, yeah. Aha. Oh. More dead versions of ourselves. Misha, I'm in the lab. There are clones of us. Everywhere. All dead. Uh, shit. Try to look around. Maybe there's something else there. What do you see? There is quite a lot of stuff here. Let's just see. Incredible growth. It will become a breakthrough in science and medicine. After this incident, we are not allowed to perform under any other circumstance. Okay. Um, further experiments. We'll put that away. Oh. Interesting. I don't think I'm going to grab that just yet until I'm told to. Slippers here. There are a few of them now. What? Boys, are you need to plan up a rat? And why are our clones here? Something's not right. I don't understand the logic. Man, this is no logic. Hold on. The glass is broken. So? The molds got into Slipper's cage. The mold? Do you know something? Top secret of the Soviet Union. Very thin findings. Extraterrestrial life form. Be careful. Well, I'm not going to put my tongue in it, am I? The atmospheric chamber. It's broken. And we've been killed. Be careful. All the robots on the station are under Zarya's control. What? No, but... What about your renowned robotics loss? She can't harm us! Exactly. Only if... They're not people. Ooh. You think it's... We are the mold. That's why she was able to kill him. But why would she do that? It is unable to operate autonomously. Zoria needs a human, and Glambit's creators for that purpose. To live forever. No. No, no. That's bullshit. You're making it up. How many shifts have we done so far? Do you remember a single one of them? It's a little bit Uh, well, that could be a side effect of anabiosis. Who told you that? Fuck. What have we done? Hmm. So we are mold people, basically. What have we got here? She is neither a human nor a child. We'll achieve nothing this way. Comrades, your task is to bring Ver 3 to Earth. Sharing any information about it is strictly prohibited. So we picked up some extraterrestrial life form in the cold, dark, dense, deep space. And um, Zari has been using it to clone versions of ourselves. So what, she can keep herself amused? Not entirely sure. Right. Um, we need to contact Earth at the control room. You have to get there somehow. 
And now the robots are probably going to kill us if they see us. Um, well, I feel... Yeah. Closed. Maybe I can break the glass? With the robotic arm. Can I use the robotic arm? I'd, I'd like to remove my dead body from the picture and do that, but... um, Or maybe the mold. Do I use the mold? Ah, oh, the mold breaks... Oh, dear. Do I want to put my hands in there? I don't think I do. So the mold reacts when I get close to it. I need to open you somehow. How do I... Can I use the controls here? I would think that I would use the controls, but apparently not. Um, so many buttons, but none of them do anything. Ah. Am I just meant to... Throw you? No. Apparently not. I feel like the robotic arm smashes through here or opens the... Closed. Maybe I can break the glass? Yeah, I'm trying to. I, I am attempting to, but there doesn't seem to be any kind of anything else that I can interact with. Or that I can pick up. Let's grab a chair. Surely the chair would break the glass. Come on. Really? Maybe I throw it out the lock? Apparently not. And none of these controls work. They were saying about the mold breaking in through the glass. What is this? I'm just chucking everything. Oh, the microscope worked. The chair didn't, though. And the other thing didn't. All right. Now I'm in like a weird biodome. We're John McLean in it again. You can't have a futuristic sci-fi horror without, you know, vents, crawling through vents and whatnot. Is this the lab? Wow, there were loads of versions of ourselves. I have a bad feeling that as soon as we start communicating with Earth, something's going to happen. I'm just going to check the room out first before we do that. Just going to just going to see maybe there's some more coins. Maybe I can open this door. No, I cannot. Um man, some bad fates went down in our clones. Can I take Oh, we have another recording. I see? Told him. I told him, give us more time, she's not ready, but they didn't listen. There we go, we are cursed, we are stuck here. There is one big disappointment. Oh dear. Right, well let's try and contact Earth, I guess. Come in, Earth, this is Icarus. Do you copy? We have an emergency. Over! What? N no. It's a radio. Oh no. Now she knows. Now she knows everything. But got some banging tunes though. Misha, <gasps> we've lost contact with the Earth. Looks like we have only one option. We need to detach. What? Abandon Zoria? N n no, Misha, I can't do that. Get yourself together, Laska, I get it. You don't get it. You never cared about her. Laska, calm down. We're in serious danger. This isn't the time for emotion. <sighs> Sorry. What needs to be done? Okay, listen. I'll start the detachment from the central module. At that moment, you need to pull the oxygen release lever. All right, all right. Got it. Misha, tell me we will come back for her. Promise. 
I promise. Yeah, I think he's going to break that promise. Uh, Zarya needs to be stopped. We have no choice. I need to go into open space to detach the central module of the station. Uh, oh, this is not going to end well, is it? This is not going to end well at all. Um, okay, I think we're going to just jump over you. Oh, we can't do that. Oh, you're not after me. Okay. Uh, how do I get into open space? That's the question. Am I meant to... Ah, uh, okay, here we go. Oh! It's a bit awkward. Uh, Oh dear. Why were you still together? It wasn't an error, Zoria. People fight. That's normal. It looks like Misha doesn't want to be friends. Let's kill him. Wow. What? What are you talking about? Don't worry. We'll make a new Misha. This one turned out to be me. He wants to shut me down. No, we won't kill anyone. Don't do that. This is wrong. Weren't you the one who said that rules are made to be broken? Yes, but not when it comes to human life. Killing is not allowed, period. I forbid it. You're talking just like Misha. Boring. Oh dear. Um, put on the spacesuit, fill it with oxygen. So this AI has gone wackadoodle. Completely wackadoodle. Uh, fill it with oxygen. How do we do that? Ah, uh, here we go. Got all the oxygen in the world, baby! Okay. And, um... Enter the... Oh, I don't know about... I don't know about this. Laska, when I gave you the signal, pull the lever. So am I waiting for his signal? He hasn't given me a signal yet. I feel if I do it now, it's too early? No. I guess we're going into space. Misha hasn't said anything. Alright. She has been lying to us this whole time. Help! Help! Who do you think you are? Freaking God, you've lost your mind! You are just a bunch of fucking microchips with errors. What are you talking about? Oscar, hurry up! Hmm. That is an interesting point. We're not human. We're mold. We're mold alien... things. Emulations of the real people. So, 
I could just, I guess, wait until my oxygen runs out, or we could detach. Are those the options here? Or is there something else over there that I'm missing? I think we'll detach. But surely, she still controls the module of the ship that we're in, right? We've detached, but does that mean we've detached from the main processing unit of Zarya? Hmm. That's an interesting one. So, instead of having my usual outro uh, with just the horrible sign, while the end credits are rolling as such, I think I'll give my final thoughts. Um, I did enjoy this as a prologue for what's to come. Oh, we have a shadow. Is that Misha? Does that mean another clone has arrived? Don't know. Yeah, um, I didn't get the vibe that, you know, we were meant to feel empathy for the AI. I think it's a very hard thing to do, um, to feel empathy for something that is essentially killing you again and again and again, and then re re resurrecting you, essentially, to be your plaything, to have conversation. Um, I did like the comparisons with Solaris, the original uh, Andrei uh, Tarkovsky uh, film uh, based on the novel. Um, yeah, there was a lot to like about this. I liked the aesthetic. Um, I did think that Laska was a little bit nonchalant at times. Um, you know, waking up from cryosleep, a bit groggy, I get that, but I didn't really... I didn't really feel the connection between her and Zarya. Misha was just basically like, we need to get the hell out of here. We need to we need to leave. This computer is trying to kill us. We are mold aliens now. And I guess, I wonder if there was an alternative ending to that, if we just basically let the oxygen run down, or maybe if I'd have gone to the other side of the ship, was there something else that we could have done to stay with our sentient AI program? Who knows? But anyway, let me know what you thought in the comments below. Uh, that was Satellite Odyssey. I, I quite enjoyed that. Um, yeah, like or dislike the video, and if you haven't already, please sub. Otherwise, I will send the sentient AI after you. Until the next one, stay ghoulish. Bye.